Welcome to the fascinating world of space exploration and discovery. The James Webb Space Telescope recently provided us with a new image of Cassiopeia A, a supernova remnant that exploded more than 300 years ago. This image was unveiled during the 2023 Holidays at the White House celebration and the first ever White House Advent Calendar by First Lady Dr. Jill Biden and NASA on December 10th. The James Webb Space Telescope can capture high-resolution infrared images, allowing us to uncover the mysteries of the universe. This video will delve into the story behind Cassiopeia A and what it reveals about the universe. So get ready to be amazed by the wonders of space as we explore this exciting new image. The new image of Cassiopeia A. The explosion of a star is a magnificent phenomenon and the remains that the star leaves behind can be even more sensational. NASA's James Webb Space Telescope has captured a new mid-infrared image that depicts one such example. The James Webb Telescope has taken a new image of Cass A using its near-infrared camera. This high-resolution look at the stellar explosion reveals intricate details of the expanding shell of material slamming into the gas shed by the star before it exploded. Cass A is one of the most well-studied supernova remnants in the cosmos, with observations from ground-based and space-based observatories, including NASA's Chandra X-ray Observatory, Hubble Space Telescope, and retired Spitzer Space Telescope. However, astronomers have entered a new era in studying Cass A. In April 2023, Webb's mid-infrared instrument started a new chapter by revealing new and unexpected features within the inner shell of the supernova remnant many of which are invisible in the new near-cam image. Astronomers are investigating why. The James Webb Telescope can observe infrared light from distant galaxies and stars using its near-infrared camera. It is invisible to our eyes, but reveals much information about their temperature, composition, and evolution. A new image, different from the same telescopes, has been captured. This image also shows the supernova remnant in infrared light, but with different colors and features. The image reveals terrific features and colors in the NERCAM's wavelength range. For instance, we can see bright orange and light pink colors representing the supernova remnant's inner shell. This is where the gas and dust are rich in elements like sulfur, oxygen, argon, and neon. These elements were produced by the new nuclear fusion inside the star before it exploded, and they tell us about the mass and age of the star. We can also see wispy knots of gas and dust that look like tiny shards of glass. These filaments are the result of the star shattering when it explodes. Some debris filaments are so tiny that even the Webb telescope cannot resolve them. This means that they are comparable to or smaller than 10 billion miles in size, roughly equal to 100 astronomical units. To put things into perspective, Cass A has a size of 10 light years, which is equivalent to 60 trillion miles across. Uncovering the Secrets of Cassiopeia A The Cass A supernova remnant has been captured by NASA's James Webb Space Telescope's NIRCAM and MIRI. Different wavelengths reveal various aspects of objects in space. The MIRI image shows the outskirts of Cass A's main inner shell in deep orange and red, while the NIRCAM image makes it look like smoke from a campfire. The dust in the circumstellar image being hit by the shockwave is too excellent to be directly detected at near-infrared wavelengths, but it lights up in the mid-infrared. The image captured by researchers shows the white color emitted by synchrotron radiation. This radiation is produced by charged particles traveling at extremely high speeds around magnetic field lines. The white light can be seen across the electromagnetic spectrum, including the near-infrared. The bubble-like shells in the lower part of the inner cavity also display synchrotron radiation, but it is not visible in the near-infrared view. The loop of green light in the central cavity of Cass A, nicknamed the Green Monster by the research team, was another intriguing feature of the image. The Green Monster glowed in mid-infrared, but was not visible in near-infrared view. Researchers found it challenging to understand this feature during their initial investigation. The synchrotron radiation and the green monster are just two of the many fascinating features of Cass A. Although the green color of the green monster cannot be seen in NIRCAM, the near-infrared region can still provide information about the mysterious feature. 
The circular holes visible in the Miri image appear faintly outlined in white and purple emissions in the NIRCAM image, representing ionized gas. Researchers believe this is due to the supernova debris pushing through and shaping the gas left behind by the star before it exploded. Baby Cassiopeia A Researchers were also absolutely stunned by one fascinating feature at the bottom right corner of NIRCAM's field of view. They're calling that giant striated blob Baby Cass A because it appears like an offspring of the main supernova. This is a light echo, where light from the star's long-ago explosion has reached and is warming distant dust, which is glowing as it cools down. The intricacy of the dust pattern and Baby Cass A's apparent proximity to Cass A are particularly intriguing to researchers. Baby Cass A is located about 170 light-years behind the supernova remnant. Several other, smaller light echoes are scattered throughout Webb's new portrait. The Implications and Impact of Cassiopeia A The image of the remnant Cass A has essential implications for astronomy and the public. It demonstrates how the James Webb Telescope can provide transformational insight into how stars explode and how they affect the universe. It also shows how the telescope can reveal new and unexpected features that challenge our understanding and spark our curiosity. By combining different wavelengths of infrared light, the telescope can create a more comprehensive picture of the supernova remnant. However, the results of the image also have some limitations and challenges. For example, the NIRCAM cannot see the coolest and faintest parts of the supernova remnant, such as the neutron star at the core of the exploded star, or the circumstellar material that is the original envelope of the star. It also cannot resolve the most minor and finest details of the supernova remnant, such as the individual grains of dust and the molecular structures. The James Webb Telescope also has to deal with technical and operational difficulties since it is located in a remote and harsh environment far from Earth, as well as human intervention. But the story doesn't end there. The telescope that captured this image and other advanced instruments and technologies will continue to observe CASSE and other astronomical objects and phenomena for years to come. The telescope will collaborate with other telescopes and observatories, both in space and on the ground, to share data and knowledge and to enhance scientific and public outreach. Moreover, CAS-8 will continue to evolve and change as it expands, cools, and interacts with the interstellar medium and the cosmic rays. Scientists will continue to study this object and others like it, using various tools and methods to unlock its secrets and shed light on the mysteries of the universe. In the meantime, Images like the one shown here will continue to inspire and captivate us, reminding us of the beauty and wonder of the cosmos and encouraging us to explore and discover more about our place in the universe. The James Webb Space Telescope's revelations on Cassiopeia A mark a milestone in astronomical exploration, unveiling cosmic secrets and pushing the boundaries of astrophysical understanding. As the JWST continues its cosmic odyssey, probing deeper into the celestial tapestry, its discoveries promise to reshape our perception of the universe, unlocking mysteries hidden within the cosmic depths. We hope you've enjoyed this video. As always, please be sure to share your thoughts down below. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel for weekly space updates. See you next time.